All right, I got a secret about personal power zones that I think a lot of you are already using and have seen, but let's go full in depth with it, guys. What is up? It is Red, the Rideshare Ginger, coming right back at you, and I'm gonna have some real info for you today. I am going to stop going after other channels. I'm gonna leave that to the experts, like the Rideshare Queen that grow their channel that way by attacking other people as he's going after Dylan right now. But that's, that is what it is, so let's, let's talk about some real info. Let's talk about how to maximize personal power zones and how to get them higher. I'm not talking about sitting and waiting in them with premium on or anything like that. That's great, that works, but I'm talking about something else, a way to maximize them. So let's take a quick look. Like, Look at all these dollar amounts that I have for the personal power zones, the PPZ. Look, look at how high some of these are. And there's tricks, it's not, it's not luck, there's tricks to it. So let, let's talk about how to make it work and how to make it happen. Gonna throw the caveat on there, you know, of it doesn't work 100% of the time and you are taking a slight risk to do some of this. So what, what, what I'm talking about and how this works is power zone pops up for you. It might be right on top of you, it might be three miles away, and let's say it's like two to three dollars, but you have consi you've had consistent pings coming through, and you got a lot coming through pretty consistently, you're gonna keep declining those, decline, 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 and after about two to three, what'll happen is the power zone will most likely move, and the number will go up. And you can do this a couple more times. I, I generally stop after like two or until it gets to a number that I like. I, I like getting it to like eight-ish dollars. I think that's a good solid number. You don't see surge normally too much higher than that when this is happening. So I try to max it out till it gets higher than the surge. And then I will, yes, maybe go drive in there, turn on my Lux Black only and go take a surged ride and then come back to lift. But this is a way to get the power zones to happen. And additionally, if there's not a power zone popping up for you, same trick works where if you decline a few trips, a power zone will pop up eventually. It, and it, again, doesn't happen 100% of the time and it is a slight risk because sometimes what will happen is you decline trip, decline trip, decline trip, power zone gone, it's not coming back. So you got to kind of know your market a little bit and know if there's requests coming through. If there's not a lot of pings that are going to be coming through or things are just slow down like there was an event and the requests aren't going to be coming through as often, then just take what you got and run with it at that point. Don't try to risk it and get a higher power, well, higher power zone. But what I'm finding is, so a lot of times it'll pop up like two or three dollars and it'll be on top of me or it might be slightly far away. It might be like a mile and a half away. So I decline rides, decline two or three, it moves and it moves closer to me and the number will go up to about $5. Decline a few more, the, it'll move again, but this time just slightly because it's already on top of me basically. So it'll move just slightly and it'll go up to seven or $8. It, that's generally kind of the tiered up the way it's worked for me. Now, what I've also seen is if I know it's super busy and it hasn't given me a power zone, I'll decline two or three, and then all of a sudden a 10 or 15 will pop up or something in that range. So sometimes it just pops, and then at that point I'm not risking anything, I'm just gonna go get my 10 or $15 and call it a day at that point. This, <sighs> and I'll put this out there, I'm not, I, I hopefully it doesn't kill me, but it's, it happens a lot in Rosemont. And it happens in Rosemont when the queue is down to basically zero, when it's a drive through or close to a drive-thru, get away from the airport, so far enough away that you're not getting pings to the airport, somewhere in Rosemont or Des Plaines area, it's not the same every time, but somewhere out there to where you're not getting pings from the airport, and somewhere between normally 17 to $25 pops. Not every time, doesn't happen all the time, but I would say a good 10% of the time I drive through Rosemont, which is often, I get at least $10 that pops up. And 5% of the time it's 25. So definitely worth it out there in the Rosemont area. This may or may not work in other markets. I can only speak to what happens in Chicago and what I'm experiencing. So I'm not guaranteeing it's gonna work for you in Austin or Detroit or wherever else you're driving, Pittsburgh. Um, yeah, it, it might not work there, but that's that's what's happening in Chicago, and it's working pretty solid for me. I, as you see, when I do like some weekly reviews, my bonuses are relatively high in comparison to some other drivers that are driving the hours that I'm driving. It, I'm doing, I think last time I reported, I think it was like 12.5% of my earnings were just the bonuses from the PPZs. So it's working for me. I like it. 
And then just quick tip to it. Obviously, if you're a premium driver, $15 pops, go drive there, turn on Lux Black only, take a surge ride on Uber if it's surging, let that money grow. It has the potential to double, but one thing you'll find is if it's a $20 zone, it's never going to double for you unless it's an event because it'll turn off and it'll eliminate the zone by the time you get like $28, maybe even 30, but it, it, it won't let you grow and let it double. It'll eventually go away because these aren't like zones that are necessarily created based off of high demand, low supply. They're putting you in areas they want you to be in. So once they get you there, there's no reason to continue offering you more money. But like I said, a lot of you probably have been doing this and know about it, but I figured I needed to get some info out here and let everyone know about it. But until next time, guys, like, comment, share, subscribe, do what you do, and I really appreciate the views.